Here's a location where I'm hooking up a three-way switch. Now I've already taken the switch out. I'm going to put an Insteon switch in place of it. This is the standard Insteon dimmer. Over on the other side, I've taken the switch out also and I'm putting a keypad in place. Here is the switch that used to be there. One is a darker color bronze screw and one is brass on one side. On the other side is another brass screw in my ground. Sometimes you may find the configuration on different sides um, where you have two brass on the same side of the switch and one bronze. But in any event, what we're trying to identify is what wire was connected to your dark color screw or your bronze screw on a three-way. Now here I know it was the black wire. So I took a meter and wanted to find out was that black wire a constant hot or is it the switch leg? So I hooked a meter from my neutral to that black wire and there was no power. So I know it's the switch leg. So I connected the red wire from my switch to that black. Now the other two wires, which I identified right here, this wire and this wire, those are my two travelers. And I don't have a neutral at the other box, so what I did is I hooked this white wire, which is a traveler, to my neutral splice. And I hooked this other switch right here. This is my power coming in because I don't have constant power here at the box. Over on this side, I do. So I have that power coming in and I connected it to the red wire going out, which is actually one of my travelers, and that's what powers up the box over there. And I happen to have that other traveler is connected now to my neutral here. I've capped off the load wire, so the load wire isn't needed. Now, you, there's multiple configurations that you'll find as you do three-way switches, um, but you can test it out the same way. In some cases, you might actually have a hot and a neutral in both locations. You don't have to use the travelers. But uh, the main point is knowing that the black or the darker screw color on a three-way switch is your hot wire coming in or your load going out. Once you identify those, know that your load wire going out, that's the one that you're going to hook the red wire to on your switch. Where your hot wire initiates, you're going to cap off the load wire.